Hey guys, just wanted to do a video about watchOS 6 and aeroplane mode. So aeroplane mode in watchOS 6 is not behaving how it was in watchOS 5. I wear my watch to bed, so in when I had watchOS 5 with the Series 4, I would put it in aeroplane mode and theatre mode, and I would track my sleep with auto sleep. Now, what's happening in watchOS 6 is when you put it into aeroplane mode, it's keeping the Wi-Fi and Bluetooth on and turning anything with this watch, the cellular, off. So I'm not sure if it does the same with the GPS only models or not, but with this Series 4 cellular, if I put it in aeroplane mode, it is leaving the Bluetooth and Wi-Fi still on. I've been reading around the net a fair bit and Everyone seems to be having this problem. I don't know if it's a bug or if it's how Apple have now intended it to be, but no one seems to have come up with any solution on how to make it just so that when you hit aeroplane mode, it turns all the radios off. So I think I may have found a solution. So you can see just normal operation there. My watch is connected to Wi-Fi and to my phone. So when I hit aeroplane mode here, aeroplane mode on, still connected to Wi-Fi, it says disconnected, but then give it a second and it'll come back up with the phone symbol again and connect to Bluetooth and there it is. So basically what happens is I'll go to bed, set aeroplane mode like this. This is what I did the first night when I put Watch OS 6 on and I'll get all my notifications and everything through on my watch in my sleep when I don't want to have any of that. I know you can use do not disturb as well, but I want to just have everything turned off and just in aeroplane mode like it used to be with no communication with the phone or anything else. So what I've, the workaround I found is you got to turn aeroplane mode on like I just did. Then you've got to get out of that, go into your settings Scroll down to Wi-Fi, turn Wi-Fi off, go down to Bluetooth and turn Bluetooth off. And now when you go back to the control center, you'll see it still says that it's connected for a second, but it's just disconnecting. You can see the Wi-Fi is off and now the Bluetooth is disconnected. So that is in true aeroplane mode. And if you want that feature back on so that it comes Wi-Fi and Bluetooth stay on, all you have to do is leave it in aeroplane mode, do the reverse, leave it in aeroplane mode. Um, <clears throat> go to settings, Wi-Fi, and you turn Wi-Fi back on. And you can do the same with Bluetooth if you wish and you can see that it's connected to Wi-Fi. So it'll be the same with Bluetooth. You can go into Bluetooth, turn Bluetooth on, and it will be connected. But I like to have mine set so that Wi-Fi is not on and Bluetooth is not on. And as you can see there, it's got nothing. And when you turn it, so when you turn airplane mode back on, It'll connect to both the Wi-Fi and your phone again. I'll watch operates like normal and airplane mode back on, disconnected. It'll flash up that it shows connected, but it's, it is actually disconnected. There you go, flashes up and goes away. So as far as I know, this is the only way to get the old airplane mode um, like watch OS 5 in watch OS 6. So I hope this helps everyone out there and everyone who's been posting on forums about this gets to see the video. Thanks for watching guys. Hope it helps. Cheers.